so much better. <laughs> With our first child. Yes. So, how did we find out? Oh, my turn. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'll start. So, actually. What did we actually find? Like, when did you start feeling sick? Well, like, we got were... engaged on October 4th, and I left to go to be an endangered species observer on a ship where I was seasick all the time. I did not continue that career path because that was not the path for me. Yeah? Yeah, that was, yep. <laughs> <laughs> and so then when I came back, I was feeling really tired and sick and I was a little bit late for my period and we had went. We thought it was all the math. I thought it was all the stress from dealing with this, <laughs> but we went over to my friend Jade's house and she was just telling me that I should go ahead and take a test to see and calm my nerves because she was like, it's probably nothing. So we got how, one of how the- late, How late were you? I think I was two weeks late, maybe? Yeah. Well, something was really stressful there at the time. I think you had just gotten back and I was still looking for a job. Yeah, we were both out of work for like a week or two or Actually, something. Actually, yeah, because my, I found out that I was going to start work. Because uh, I, I started work like the next day after we found out. Yeah, yeah. So, we were both out of work and it was really stressful. So I thought that was just late due to stress. And so Jade was like completely like, yeah, it's, you're probably not. We should just check. So we got the box that has three pregnancy tests in it. And I went in the bathroom at her house while he was setting up her Amazon fire stick thing. And then I had Jade and, well, I was having Jade check the test for me, but she took Jason with her. And like literally, I remember I took the test, set it on like the bathroom sink upside down or whatever way that it tells you to do it and I was like okay it's like two or three minute wait and then you guys can go check it so they go back there and I'm standing out in the living room and I can hear them I can literally hear them talking for like two to three minutes like I don't know man uh what do you think what do you think blah, 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 blah. it totally was like you could tell it was like a very faint line but uh because it was supposed to be like two lines. The first line was solid for sure. And the second line was like was like a shadow. And the box clearly says like if there's any If indication, there's anything, if, like, yeah. Like anything. It has to be like completely clear for it to be negative. And it was like barely there. So like Jade was trying to be like. No. She's, she's like, <laughs> no. I mean, it's, it's only like a little bit. She's like, she's probably not. No worries. And like in the back of my mind, just so like I was on board with Jade the whole time. But like in the back of my mind, I was like, dude, she's <laughs> yeah so they came out with that one and they were still whispering as they walked out and Jade's just like you're taking all the rest of the ones in the box we're not talking about you're taking the rest of the ones in the box no I don't think it was like we just wanted to take a second one at that point we were like she told me to take all of them I took both of those at the same time I didn't oh, even take them separately I didn't know that. she she had me take them at the same time she's like just go ahead take two of them so that they'll both test the same stuff and We'll see, so I took two more. And it was really hard for you to pee, so you know how like, uh, you know when, uh, you know when you drink beer, you pee a lot? So we no. you just have like three or four. I drank like a <laughs> huge bottle of water and I was chugging it. These are all jokes. Okay. Yeah, there was no beer. <laughs> she went to go pee, she got to two sticks at once, and then when she got done with the two sticks, it was like, one of them was like super clear. It was like, 
nothing on it. The other one was like two solid fucking lines. And then we didn't show Brooke the the other two. So this time we had taken three. Okay. And we wanted to make sure. I, like I thought already that like for sure she's pregnant. Jade was still like, eh, yeah. Jade wasn't convinced with the. <laughs> <sighs> wasn't convinced with the other tests, so we sent him to go get the digital one. So both of the digital tests said pregnant. And Jason wasn't shocked at all. He was very excited. We were both not shocked really because we had been talking about having children for a while and Jason got googly eyed at like every baby that we saw for like months leading up to this. So I feel like he was just really excited. And then Jade cried because she was overwhelmed with emotions. This like full disclosure, full disclosure? Yeah. Like we thought that you wouldn't be able to have babies. So that was something that, you know, before you even shot Brooke even went on the ship, it was really stressful because, uh, you know, not being able to have children is, is pretty rough to go through. But we were already talking about wanting to adopt. Um, you know, we, we really wanted to have a kid. So, you know, we were also, I proposed to you before you went on the ship. Yes. Let's just make that one clear. Yeah. <laughs> <clears throat> it just happened very quickly. Like, he proposed and then we found out that we were pregnant a month okay. later. I didn't think that I would be able to have children. So we did view it as a blessing. Anyways, uh, we didn't want to tell anybody first, right? Well, they tell you not to tell anyone until you're 12 weeks because of the possibility of miscarriage. So we weren't going to tell anybody, but like I'm the first person in my friend group to become pregnant. So I have not really had like friends to go talk to for advice or like how to get through. I was really, really sick for the whole first trimester. So I think we waited about a week and then I had talked to Jason about telling my mom just so that I'd have someone to talk to who could like kind of guide me through it. Because okay. when I called the doctor, like the night that we found out that I was pregnant, <clears throat> we, the next morning I called like a couple of different gynecologists because I needed a new gynecologist um, for insurance purposes. But I had to call a whole bunch of places and none of them seemed like eager to get me in the door, which was weird to me because I've never been pregnant before. But I thought that like someone would want to at least like be like, yeah, for sure you're pregnant. But they all seemed like, okay, you had five pregnancy tests tell you that you were, so we'll wait until you're 10 weeks. So that's, once we told my mom, we went out and got like prenatal vitamins and a whole bunch of stuff before we even saw the doctor because I wanted to be proactive about it and it was just kind of weird to me that they didn't want to see me yet. Um, so yeah, we told my mom first and then for Thanksgiving is when we told everyone else. Mm -hmm. So we like, we took a picture with my family <clears throat> where we all got together and my mom took the picture because my mom already knew. Yeah, we all stood in front of my mom's um, refrigerator because that's just where we take all of our family pictures. And once we got all together, I guess no one was really on page with me because he we was were, shocked. They thought we were taking a family photo. Yeah, they just thought that we were taking a picture. And so instead of saying, say cheese, I just said, say Brooke's pregnant or Brooke's having a baby. I think you said Brooke's pregnant. I think I said Brooke's having a baby. Yeah, Brooke's having a baby. I was sitting there and like I was, I mean, I knew we were doing it, but like not at the time, you know, like I knew we were going to do it at Thanksgiving. So when we like all got up for a family photo, I was like, oh, family photo. <laughs> <laughs> I went and stood and Brooke was like up towards the front in the middle and I was like towards the back. And uh, when Brooke was like, everybody say one, two, three. I thought she was gonna say cheese. And then she was like, say Brooke's pregnant. And then like my first thought, because we had been like keeping it a bit of a secret in the past, was like, dude, shut up. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, so like she tricked me too. 
Yeah, so no one was really expecting it. And it was a pretty good picture. So if I know how to put it in here, I'll put it on the screen at some point. Um, so that's how we told my family. And then I don't know if it was that night or like during the next week we called his family, but there was like a total of like eight people on this phone call and we told them all at once. So that was kind of the same as when I told my family. Um, and yeah, so that is all we're gonna talk about for this video, but we might go ahead and film the gender reveal while we're here so that I can put that together for you guys. So. <laughs> <laughs> So anyways, thank you guys so much for watching and taking this journey with us. And we're excited to show baby these videos when they're older. So hit the like button if you liked it, subscribe and comment any questions or anything below. We'd love to hear from you guys. You know what, seriously though, like I want to add something up on there here. Okay. We call it a saved round in the business. Uh, like vlogging actually, like I had to like remember everything that we did. And now I'm gonna be able to like, I would be able to go watch the video. Yeah. So like it was actually really cool because I didn't really think it was gonna be like that, but now like I can go back, like I, I it forced me to remember, like sequentially or yeah. chronologically, or whatever. And how you felt at that time? Logically. Yes. Yeah. And like how I felt, so it's pretty cool. Yes. Yeah. Okay. So that's <laughs> thoughts from Jason, <laughs> and we'll see you guys next time. Bye. <laughs> Bye. Okay. <laughs> <laughs>